Hello, my name is Masa Koinima. I'm a component lead of Rational Team Concert and Rational Queercase Connectors. I'm going to demonstrate the new enhancement on the bridge integration that provides more seamless integration of Rational Team Concert with Rational Queer Team Explorer for UCM operations. The substance of the bridge integration between Rational Team Concert and Clear Team Explorer are the relationships and the traceability established between the Team Concert work item and the ClearCase UCM activities or base ClearCase versions. The bridge allows a developer to use ClearCase for version control but still take advantage of RTC features. In the newly enhanced bridge integration for UCM, the ClearCase version control operations are seamlessly integrated with Rational Team Concert work item, and you do not have to manually associate your UCM activity with RTC work item. You can ensure all of your work is associated with and traceable from RTC work items. It is available for Rational Team Concert 4.0 and Rational ClearCase 8.0.0.2 or later. Although this demo shows only UCM operation, you can also use the RTC with Clear Team Explorer for base ClearCase operation. Please watch other videos or read documentations available at jazz.net for more information about base ClearCase integration. Here you see my Eclipse Workbench with Rational Team Concert Client and Rational Clear Team Explorer. Enabling the bridge integration is as simple as installing Rational Team Concert and Clear Team Explorer into the same Eclipse shell. You can use either Eclipse Installer or IBM Installation Manager. Let's start with a simple Java project. Here I have a Java project, bridge demo project which is version controlled by Rational ClearCase UCM. And I'm going to add a new Java class, sample D. Then the Clear Team Explorer pops up the Add to Source Control panel. Normally you would create or select a UCM activity to add the new file into UCM version control. But what I'm going to see here by clicking Find button is the Select Work Item panel for Rational Team Concert. And what I'm going to see here by clicking New button is the Create Work Item panel. Let me create a work item here. Now that I see a UCM activity, adding sample D, task 6524, is created and selected in the activity field. When I click OK to the Create Work Item panel, the bridge creates both RTC work item and UCM activity, associate them each other, and select the UCM activity for the Add to Source Control operation. The bridge assigns UCM activities ID that matches work items ID with user specified prefix and also provides UCM activities headline which is identical to the work items summary. The prefix of the UCM activity is configurable by the preference page. Let's click OK button and add the Java file to the source control and verify the work item and its association. When I finish the Add to Source Control operation, the work item is set as current work item. I can open the work item from the status bar field at the right bottom. And if I go to the Links tab, 
I can find a UCM activity is associated here. Let me click the open button and I can find all the versions for the change set. Now I will set up a code review approval by my peer developer, Paul. I go approvals tab and select the new approval button and set him as an approver. I'm adding some comments and save. Paul will review the code by navigating the associated change set from this work item, like the way I just did. After Paul's review, I check the approval status. He found the copyright statement is missing from sample D. He also created a defect for me. Now I go back to the Java code and add the copyright statements. I first go to the UCM toolbar and select the activity creation button. I get the select work item panel instead of the UCM activity creation panel. From here I can either select a work item or create a new work item from the left bottom link. Let's select the defect Paul submitted for me and press OK. The bridge integration creates a UCM activity for the selected work item, associate it, and set it for the current view. I will then check out sampled.java and add the copyright statement. You will notice that the UCM activity created by the UCM toolbar it's selected for the checkout operation here. Let me select OK and I'm going to add the copyright statement. And I'll check the file in. Again, the UCM activity associated to the work item is selected here. Let me click OK. Lastly, let's verify the activity association with the work item. Again, the work item associated to the current UCM activity is set as current work item, so I can open it from the status bar at the right bottom. And if I go to the links tab, I can find the associated UCM activity. Let me click the open button and I can find the version for the change set. And if I select the compare with predecessor menu, I can see the change I just made. As I just demonstrated, all of the work that you check into Rational Career Case is associated to the Rational Team Concert work item automatically through UCM operations. I hope you've enjoyed the demo. Thank you.